Hi everyone, Sensei Dong here. In this video, we'll be reviewing the kata Shihohai. This is a very good kata to do if you have a small space. Let's get the video started. Shihohai! We open the move, we open the kata with a sh striking move, a blocking move, and a horse dance. So we'll put that together. Slow. I take my right elbow behind me as I use my front hand to support my left hand. And as I do that, I look towards my left. Again, dynamic tension, slow. From here, the kata follows four horse dances, all with punches and ki eyes. Our first ki eye is here, I move my right leg and punch with my right hand. Hi! I move my left leg, punch with left hand to that wall. Hi! I look to my left, but I punch with my right to this wall. I look forward again, I move my left hand, I move my left leg, and my right punch. The kata now follows a series of hook stances and front stances. I look to my right, go to hook stance, back fist. I throw front kick. Land, punch face chest. Look behind me. I move my left leg. Hook stance. Back fist. I throw front kick. Land. I punch face chest. From here, I do a crane stance. Now, crane stance is a blocking stance. If someone is kicking, I'm deflecting. Here. At the same time, as I do my block with my right leg, my right hand also does a low block. Right here. At the same time, Blocking, low blocking. From here, as I throw my side kick, I take my blocking hand and bring it to my rib cage as I kick at the same time. X block. From here, I take a deep breath in and I do a dynamic tension double elbow. Exhaling all of my air. From here, I do the same thing on my left. I block with my left leg and low lock at the same time. Like so. As I go to kick now, be sure to bring the hand back to chamber. So I'm doing this at the same time. Next block. Land in good horse stance. Breathe in. And exhale. As I exhale, I bring my hands back to chamber. My next series of movements are 
behind me and in front. So from here I'm taking my back fist with my right hand. As I move my right leg in, right hand goes on top, turning towards front stance behind me. Back fist, so like so. Followed by two punches to the chest. As I move my front leg in, there's my setup. Front stance towards front. And another back fist. And I punch, punch. I step forward in this cow. So, in this kata, there are two other ki eyes. They're on the last two back fists. So, as we set up for our horse stance, and we turn towards the back, and do our, our back fist, before our double punch, there's a ki eye like so. I look, I set up, hey! punch, punch. Same thing going behind me, I look, I set up, hey! punch, punch. And step forward. In this kata, it's really important to recoil the kicks. For instance, front kick. Snap it back. Then stance. And same thing with side kick. As we're blocking here, when you throw side kick, be sure to kick and bring it back. Okay? Again, kick and then back. Always have control over your kicks. You don't want to kick and just drop your leg. Kick, recoil, and then land. So it's more of a solid stance. And same thing with your side kick again, guys. You throw the kick, as you're blocking, right? You throw the kick, and then back down. This way you're gonna get a better stance. You're gonna hit your stance better more times. And Hachi. So give this cat a try. Like I said, it's a really good kata to do in a small area. And the four punches at the beginning, you can use the walls as reference. It's a straight horse stance to this wall. Another straight, you don't want, you don't want to be on an angle. You want to be parallel with the wall. You can use this wall also as reference. And then a front wall for your other one. Practice, leave a comment down below and I'll see everybody in the next video.